Welcome to the pastor's study. Today I'm looking at a verse of scripture found in the book of Amos. The prophet Amos is warning Israel that God is bringing judgment upon them. And in Amos chapter 4, we read in verse 10, For I have sent among you the pestilence after the manner of Egypt. Your young men have I slain with the sword and have taken away your horses. And I have made the stink of your camps to come up from uh, unto your nostrils. Yet have you not returned unto me, saith the Lord. I have overthrown some of you as God overthrew Sodom and Gomorrah. And you have as a firebrand plucked out of the burning. Yet have you not returned unto me, saith the Lord. Therefore thus I will I do unto thee, O Israel. And because I will do this unto thee, prepare to meet thy God. Many years ago, when my grandfather was living, he was a hunter and he would go to the woods and wherever he went hunting, you would find, especially uh, on the beech trees, you would find carved these words, prepare to meet thy God. I remember the first time that I saw them as I was going through the woods and I came to this old beech tree and there carved into it were these words, prepare to meet thy God. It was a startling uh, thing to see there in the woods when you were not expecting it. Later on, we would go out just to look at it and marvel that those words were still there, carved into the tree, prepare to meet thy God. When God deals with the nation and the nation refuses to obey, then judgment comes on that nation. And God allows judgments to fall upon the nation, trying to awaken them to their sin and awaken them to their need. And the nation that refuses to heed the voice of God, then he will bring further judgment upon them. America is at a point right now where judgment is falling upon us. From the pandemic to the southern border being open and people coming in from all over the world, some of them terrorists to be caught uh, or not to be caught uh, in the nation, preparing to do great damage to this nation. And God speaks to us today and he says to us this, prepare to meet your God. You have not hearkened to me. You have not listened to my voice. I have warned you. I have, I have sent judgment on you to waken you and still you will not prepare to meet me. And so now he says to us in America, prepare to meet your God. What does he mean, prepare to meet your God? It is a very serious warning that God has given. He is saying the judgment that will fall will be a greater judgment, a harsher judgment than has yet fallen. We have seen the judgment of the pandemic upon us where Thousands and thousands and thousands have died from it. We have seen the judgment where we have seen an invasion into our country. We have seen where the nation has turned against marriage and, and has legitimized all kinds of debauchery. And yet we do not heed the warning calls of God. And so the Lord says to us today, O Israel, or maybe he's saying, O America, because I will do this unto you, prepare to meet thy God. I would ask you today, cry out to the Lord for mercy for America. Cry out to the Lord for mercy on your own family and life that God will spare us from the greater judgment that is sure to fall if America does not repent. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray, help us to prepare to meet you by humbling ourselves before you, by submitting to your will, and by repenting of our sin, that as a nation we might fall on our knees and say, O oh God, forgive us for our sin. For we ask this in Christ's name. Amen.